it's marathon week we can't sleep so why not do a little introspective of uh, 10 years of deck we're going to take some look back at some things that uh we're losing from 2021 that in 2022 that's not happening things or people mm -hmm. and then we're going to take a look ahead of uh our all toddler lineup looking at the future of deck in about 16 years it's interesting how deck has grown in 10 years now you know so we started on one deck with about 18s and here we are now with multiple locations and multiple divisions and just grows 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 so mm -hmm. how many uh divisions do you think there'll be when our toddler team mm. plays man it might be up to like a d11 you know i don't know but <laughs> come a long way from getting spanked in the first season 21 nothing to valley bank and having ryan corkin leave in the middle game because he said fuck it and i can't believe you <laughs> <laughs> to here we are now so oh, are you ready i'm ready all right, uh, all these pictures were drawn by my wife, Courtney, and my daughter, Alexis, takes some credit, too. I really haven't seen many of these, so let's take a look at what we lost. Bo Reed. Bo Reed, man, what a solid individual. Great player. Uh, teammate one time that was great. Fortunately, Bo says the doctor says no more no more deck hockey no more ever or just ever oh. ever so now you can enjoy your white socks Bo. white socks jersey yeah nike hat yeah i have a clock shadow we're gonna miss you Bo. I'm not gonna miss your shot as an opponent but i'm certainly gonna miss him so Aww. love you Bo. Our segment, ooh, the second one. I think I'm gonna do this. We'll yeah, you tear that in half. Well, no, we'll get to the second one. Oh, okay. Half. That's Lindsay Womack. At the end of last year, she said she was retired and she actually meant it. Mm -hmm. So. Because she wanted to spend more time with Spend more time with the family. You know what? Real winners do, like Tom Brady, they unretire and spend time playing sports. So. That's Lindsay with her family on the left and her four kids who she needs to spend time with. <laughs> and then there's her captains who are lonely now. <laughs> Me, Jugs, Selena, and Lindsay Schmidt. So, we've agreed the following sanctions are in place for you, Mrs. Womack. And I hope you can hear this from Costa Rica. <laughs> Because when you get back, you are banned from Coffee Apothecary. Yes. No more. No more. Lindsay Schmidt says, you get in there, you're done, you're arrested. My Piazza will be coming for you. Super Target, you're just banned from because I just decided so. So think twice. Yeah. Next. Yeah, I'm, done. I'm so mad with it. I'm so mad. I know you're mad. <laughs> Springfield Deck Hockey. Oh, no, they're, they're, they're actually still going strong. Well, maybe strong, but they barely, maybe got four teams. That's CPR. They're doing CPR. That's yes. CPR. Maybe Springfield's being strong. given. This, Alexis yeah. drew this one for us. If you ever want to win, a, the easiest way to win a cup is to go up and play in Springfield, and you have about 50% chance we start the season. So. <laughs> All right. Wait, wait. Yeah. Sorry, we're closed. Is this Waterloo deck hockey? This is Waterloo Oof, deck hockey. Man. I hope these aren't showing up backwards on the video. <laughs> that would be totally bad. That would be really bad. That'd be really bad. I guess we'll find out. I'd hate to do this video over again. Uh-huh. Anyways, man, what a loss. City Council basically told us to get our shit and get out, huh? I think so. They wanted what? their space back. <laughs> What are the businesses downtown supposed to do now? How are those fine businesses what that we did like reviews on? Subway and the light. That, the brewery was really good. I'm talking fine establishments. The brewery was good. Fine establishments. Mm -hmm. oh, oh. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> there you go. What am I supposed to do Memorial Weekend now? Celebrate my birthday. Camp? 
Yes. Uh, vacation? Yes. This is ridiculous. Find another home. Warn. Call. Get on it. <laughs> this cannot happen. I'm going to miss Waterloo. What's Warren going to do? Is he on? He's not on one of the He's, new teams, is he? We will talk about Mr. Warren tomorrow. Okay. I never got to talk to him in Chicago. I was a little bit upset. You actually did, but go ahead. I said hi. I was talking to him. Okay. Athena for mayor. <laughs> <laughs> that, yeah, that's not happening. She got railroaded by that other dude that's been there. Yeah, yeah that's, yeah. That, how should I put it? I liked her, but she's a little too out there. Like, gotta rein it in, girl, a little bit. Yeah. Like, I'm all for civil rights. I'm not black. I don't know what black people are going through, but you also can't alienate, like, everybody. You know? Just my thoughts. I don't know. Mm -hmm. But good luck next time. Maybe you can, like, run for, like, Long Grove or something. or Alderman. Alderman, yeah. Just a thought. What have we got here? Oh, yeah, the Quad City Thunder. I guess if you're a... Either a, like a CBA basketball team here or a hockey team here, I'm going to eventually end up defunct. So I'm going to miss them. They had some good players. You know, our f former guest, Phil Bittner, was on that team. Oh, yeah. Nice. Andy Williams, yeah. Uh, they had a bunch of cool guys. So RIP, Quad State Thunder. Another piece of art by Alexis. Well Not done. <laughs> <laughs> this is our final one? This is our final All one. All right. Anybody know who the bun belongs to? Signature messy bun. Danny Sachakli. <laughs> <laughs> There's really gonna be a mini Sachakli. Oh my god, is that what the world needs? She straight up texted me right before, right when she knew. And she said, Mark, straight up, I don't wanna play with you anymore, so I got pregnant. Because I know this is, you're probably done soon, so. <laughs> I'm going to get pregnant and not have to play at the end and then just come back and play next year without you. And I said, no, that, that hurts. But congrats or whatever. So I'm like noticing a trend. All my line mates, they just like disappeared. Maybe that's a sign it's time for you. Well, maybe that's a sign I'm the one with issues, right? Because like Joe Penniston, Aww. gone. Never heard from him again. Unless he's at like some food truck somewhere. He's not riding up bike. Lindsay, pff, gone. Spending time with her family. Danny, gone. Have another baby. Whatever. Another, like she has ten others. Oh, I mean. two. <laughs> so. All right. Well, whatever. I Maybe mean, I'll, I'll put a ring on it now. Uh, well. Why does no one care about me and my feelings? I care about you and your feelings. Thank you. You're welcome. So, anybody wants to be on the line with me this year, give me a I ring. I've offered. Yeah? 500 times. Cool. So that's what we lost in 2021, <laughs> going into 2022, unfortunately. But when you lose things, you gain things, supposedly, right? Mm-hmm. So I'd like to announce... Presented by Wild Crew Clothing. Have you checked out their online boutique shop? They have some really cute stuff. They really do. Kids are too old for it, though. Yeah, they are proud to present the first annual Under the Traffic Lights All Toddler Team. Now, yeah, great apparel there. I've been talking to these toddlers. I'm sure you have. <laughs> daycares and such, they would call me and say, Mark, our parents, you know, we're just embarrassed going to these daycares. You know, we're not getting the appropriate clothing that we'd like to wear. That's cool to, you know, show off to our friends. You know, they're, they're taking them to the regular department stores. They're taking them to Goodwill. I'm saying, <laughs> check out Wild Crew Clothing. These kids look hip. They do. It's really cute stuff. So. Do you want to show them Jenny's baby? The little girl and her cute little... Uh, no, because okay. I'm not on that page and I forgot to do something in the last segment I wanted to do. Oh, but, okay. you know, whatever. 
It is what it is. But you love me. Um, but yeah, yeah, these babies right out of the womb, like even in the womb, they're they're texting saying, "Hey, like it's gonna be embarrassing coming out naked. Please have something on standby in these birthing centers. You know, that's something cool when you come out. You look cool." Right? Like, as they come out? As they come out. Yeah, like that's they're how... already dressed when they're in their mommy's bellies. Yes. <laughs> that's, that's what these kids are saying. That's what they're coming up telling me. Okay. This is why they're okay. filling the void. All right. So, check it out. Inner, uh, there's a p promo code right now. If you go online, 25% off. You just enter UTL. That's not a sexual transmittal disease. It's under the lights. 25% off. Why? <laughs> I mean, maybe we can talk to Sam about it, but... I think Sam... Until then, don't lie. I think Sam and Jordan are going to have a talk with me, and it's probably not going to go well on my end. <laughs> <laughs> Mark, you can't stop for <laughs> They should be appreciative of the sponsorship provided. They should. <laughs> So all those fifteen people that this video is gonna so, reach. So wild crew clothing, girl. All toddler team. Are you ready? I'm ready for this. This is like twenty thirty eight. I got probably both feet in the grave, not just one. But these kids will be dominating the fourth deck at Crow Creek Park, right? Well, the huh? Okay. Nope. Go ahead. What? Nope. I would like for you to proceed with your list. I, yeah, would, I would say too. something inappropriate. We don't do inappropriate things here. Number one on the toddler list, Bennett Wiseman. Beep. Proud parents, Danny and Amanda Wiseman. Ooh, this kid's going to be an absolute He's stud. He's going to be a star. It's like a farm, you know, you just raise hockey kid after Are hockey you kidding kid. me? Technical difficulties when I'm presenting the highest honors to these kids. Sorry. Bennett Wiseman, I said. Yes. Will be. Will be. Little B, I called him. Oh, Little B. Just think of that from Bob down to Danny and Amanda, and now we got Bennett. Did you see him trucking in that John Deere yes. little truck the other day? <laughs> he was like picking, serious business. Gonna be picking up the chicks, taking that thing over to deck and just doing business. Man, congrats, Bennett. What an honor. I would figure. Yes. Number two, Luca Levesque. Proud parents Pat and Samantha Levesque. It's a no-brainer, right? Mm-hmm. I mean, I mean, Louis obviously over the hill, so he's not. <laughs> I think what I heard too. What well, didn't Sam say when we interviewed her? It's fine that Louis doesn't really have the interest in the hockey, but Luca always has a stick in his hand. I knew that. That's why I never, never had Louis down for a toddler. Is it? Yeah, team. So, hmm. congrats, Luca. You're going places. It's no. You bet you you are. All right, we'll move on, because that's obviously no brainer, and I got no brain. Number three, Maya Huber. Is it Maya or Mia? Mia Huber, Chris and Danielle Huber. Congratulations. She's gonna be an engineer and a hockey player. I heard for that baby to come out, it took like twenty four hours because the baby just stopped everything, just like she doesn't go. I've been thinking of that for quite a while. Oh my God. <laughs> but yeah, you know she's just going to tear it up. Just like her parents. She will be very talented in the athletic department. Yeah. Sure. Congrats. What an honor. The next one's my favorite. My old chunker monk that I don't know well enough yet. Palmer <laughs> Womack. Woohoo! Parents Mike Womack and Morgan McDermott. Ah, here's the deal. Yeah. She's going to be like the cutest one on the toddler team. She's got some pictures taken with our sponsor I saw. She's got sponsor? she's got clothing on Wild Crew. Oh, does but, she? Yeah. Aww. She's already done business with our sponsor. Nice. Here's what's going to happen, right? Palmer's going to play junior leagues, right? Mm -hmm. And as a forward. And there's going to be a little goalie coming out. 
Mia? To play the ball. No, I don't want to be Mia. Oh, okay. I don't want Mia to get ran over. Oh, okay. Oh, that's where I was getting at. But, yeah, so there's this little... The Palmer goes, boom, and just runs over the goalie. <laughs> just like her daddy. Oh, gosh. She's too pretty for that. It doesn't matter. They can do mean things, too. So... Congrats, Palmer, and of course that's home cooking because Morgan's like part of our family. She's your cousin. My cousin, I knew that. <laughs> God. Actually, her mom, or yeah, dad is your cousin. Yeah. So she's your second cousin. Second cousin. Number five. Isla. Isla Blackby. <laughs> Proud parents, Dakota Blackby and Sherry Sutterstorm. No brainer, right? Mm -hmm. If you're going to be Dakota's daughter, that you're going to ball out and you, you get to 2038 is the year I'm looking at, you know? Mm -hmm. Woody probably still be recruiting kids that age, come out. <laughs> probably Grandpa he's, Woody. <laughs> he's got the ends on all the kids, man. He leaves nothing for us. Mm -hmm. We get like the 16 over crowd, the rest of the band. It's Woody's like handing out business cards to 10 year olds. You're almost there. <laughs> You're almost Come there. Play with me. Come play with me. So, mm -hmm. number six, Emmett Worden. Oh, the newest member. Proud parents, Brian <coughs> and Calissa Worden. Brian does two things well. He drinks beer and he creates kids. Sorry. That does really well for our videos when we get on it. <laughs> I can cut that part out. So I got to assume this kid's going to be a stud. He's going to be drinking beers left and right and doing the hockey. Mm -hmm. So He's going to be tough because he's got two older brothers to, like, yeah. he's going to have to defend himself from day one. And who knows how many younger brothers are coming. <laughs> Hopefully a sister someday. Yeah. <sighs> Poor Calissa. Poor Calissa is right. Thankfully, Brian's never on Facebook, so he'll never see this. Numbers or the YouTube. I don't think he's that advanced for his for his age. I don't think he's the younger than us, isn't he? Yeah, he's younger than us, but technology I don't think is a strong suit. And he owns a business. Technology. Yeah, I'll get be. with that tomorrow. When, okay. Yeah, Next. I got my feelings about that. Number seven, hated Bud. Proud parents, David and Heather Bud. Hayden, you know how he got that name because he's a big Hawkeye fan. Oh, I like yeah. it. Yeah. Right, and his Hawkeye fans have nothing to do but toddler <laughs> lineups. <laughs> but congrats, you two. If that, if that Hayden's hat the defenseman David is, good things are coming. So, number eight, his fellow buddy. Well, maybe, buddy, you know, the other Max Seifert, proud parents, Mitch and Breland Seifert. Hmm. Mitch, Mitch is, he's, he's a well, he's a well-built man. And he's got a hell of a game, a nice shot, all-around game. And Mac, I'm sure, is just going to grow up to be the same way, you know, so. Mm -hmm. Probably. 20, dad. yeah. What a bunch of just animals are going to get after here in 2038 you know they're the a lot of them are going to be called the chosen ones so we're going to have to put this one on the team because we still need mm -hmm. two so the mini well is going to have to be on if there. you're not born yet i can't put you on the toddler team well emmett was just born just born that one's still in the womb a couple months doesn't matter it matters this is legitimate <laughs> okay a legitimate team yes it is if you want me to do an all womb lineup, I'll get to it. <laughs> so please, thank you for the last 10 years, and here's to a few more. Thank you to Wild Crew Clothing for sponsoring this, even though they didn't know they sponsored it. <laughs> they do now. I think they Sam actually watches these. Oh boy. <laughs> might be a long year for me <laughs> so that's it i hope you just tune in the 
No, I ain't doing that today. Okay. <laughs> the, <laughs> tune in the rest of the week as we have a couple more guests lined up for, or three guests lined up for a few more divisions. So, yeah. till then, God bless and good night, America.